Hello, I'm Trevor from Pico Technology and what we're looking at here is the Picoscope 4824 USB connected oscilloscope. It has eight channels, each with 20 MHz bandwidth and a buffer memory of 256 mega samples. Each channel has 12 bits vertical resolution. It makes it ideal for a wide range of applications in power measurements and other embedded systems applications. What we're seeing at the moment is a number of trends that are affecting the embedded design world. So there is rapid development of a number of sensors, sensors that are being used to measure environmental conditions, things like temperature, uh, gas, fuel flow and that sort of thing, vibration, positioning. We're also seeing the introduction of a number of parallel processing techniques. So multi-core central processing units, graphics processing units, and field programmable gate arrays. Embedded systems contain persuasive serial buses. So there are serial buses everywhere. I squared C, SPI, UART, and custom serial protocols. And we're seeing a number of low energy systems. So systems that are employing energy harvesting techniques with very small signal amplitudes that require high resolution measurements to validate their characteristics. It's interesting to look as well at what's going on in the power world. So the, um, the power semiconductor market is undergoing significant changes, in particular with the introduction of silicon on carbide and uh, gallium nitride uh, processors and devices that are enabling all sorts of new power controls. Power quality is also something that's particularly important. So there are industry regulations that government organisations are demanding for the delivery of good quality power for businesses and in the home. That has a number of implications for people who are making me measurements of those waveforms. So embedded system developers need to measure waveforms on more channels than before. So traditionally, oscilloscopes had either two or four analog channels and in some cases a number of digital channels. We're needing to measure more than four channels these days. We're also needing to measure with higher resolution. So eight bits or gives 256 levels and in many cases that's not enough for some of those sensors and some of those power applications that we just mentioned. It's also useful to be able to see waveforms over long periods of time with good resolution, with good timing resolution. So deep memory is something that enables that kind of measurement. The Picoscope 4824 is the first measurement device in its class to offer eight channels with 12 bits of vertical resolution, deep buffer memory with 256 mega samples, and 20 megahertz bandwidth. On the front panel, we have each of the eight input channels, and on the rear panel, we have an additional um, arbitrary waveform generator and function generator, and the connection to a USB 3 interface, which gives the, uh, the communications interface to the host computer, as well as power to the scope itself. Inside, each of the eight channels is screened to ensure good signal integrity and good measurement fidelity. And in fact, that's shown here with a spurious free dynamic range of better than 60 dB. The front panel software is with the familiar Picoscope application, and we're seeing here all eight channels in use simultaneously, looking at some, some serial bus activity and uh, a bit of analog activity on, on channel 8 there at the bottom of the screen. The Picoscope software enables a number of viewports to be set up. So in this example, we've got the screen divided into four viewports with um, an overview of the activity of the device under test at the top left, a detailed view of the serial bus activity top right, um, a look at the, uh, the SPI bus by the look of it on the bottom left, and a spectral view on the bottom right. Having eight channels enables us to observe and to debug multiple serial buses with long data streams at the same time. 12 bits resolution is high resolution to enable us to look at those outputs from the sensors that are so challenging. And of course, the, the built-in arbitrary waveform generator enables us to simulate missing sensors and to add noise and jitter to our designs to stress test the, the design to make sure that it works, even in the presence of corrupted signals. 
12 bits resolution is ideal for looking at detailed power analysis. So you can monitor voltage and current waveforms over extended periods with the deep buffer memory. So with the Picoscope application, we can measure about five minutes of activity. And with the software development kit, it's limited actually only by the size of the hard disk. Picoscope offers high-end features across all the portfolio of Picoscope oscilloscopes. So serial bus decoding, mask limit testing, advanced mathematics, extensive measurements are all included as standard. It's good for general purpose applications and applications that require sophisticated triggers. And Picoscopes come included with an arbitrary waveform generator or a function generator as standard. We also provide a software development kit. So if you need to produce a custom application for making uh, some specific measurements, then you can do so using languages such as C Sharp, C++, LabVIEW, or interface to MATLAB. Picoscope is also available for Linux and for Mac applications. So all of the current versions of Picoscope hardware are supported and various different versions of, of Linux and Mac OS X. And finally, we see here an example of a split screen Picoscope application running on Linux with the time domain at the top and the frequency domain representation of the signal showing at the bottom. Okay.